On October 17th, at 5.04 p.m., Northern California was rocked by a 7.1 magnitude earthquake on the San Andreas Fault at Loma Prieta, just 10 miles from the University of California, Santa Cruz. The McHenry Library and the Science Library escaped major structural damage, but nearly 100 stack ranges collapsed and close to 100,000 volumes were thrown to the floor, forcing the closure of the libraries three weeks into the fall quarter. This is the, uh, where the literature is. Small. But this is over in the second section, though, isn't it? Right, but the stacks didn't fail. Oh, the stacks didn't, right. just See, the books fell This out. is not my problem. Oh. This is my problem. Uh -huh. over there. <laughs> but uh, it's not a bad thing to do to have some house cleaning to do, and people don't like the library looking like this. So mm -hmm. my problem has been to find safe areas for them to be able to do that in. Again, this is the fourth floor of the main library. The worst damage in the kingdom. And down here. This really showed. Most of the damage occurred in the stacks of the oldest section of the McHenry Library, which was completed in 1966. Minor damage was sustained on the first and second floors, while the third and fourth floors suffered widespread stack collapse and an avalanche of books. Yeah, essentially what we're doing almost is triage right now that is dealing with the problems that we're having to make some hard decisions as to what problems we deal with first. And obviously, we don't want to touch the fourth floor of McHenry Library until we have some sense as to uh, how it's going to be dealt with. And we can learn that by dealing with similar but smaller problems on the other floors. Um, our goal is to have the first and second floor, there's the main floor and the floor below, open Monday morning, 8 o'clock when class is open. And the sad thing is that I see it will be a matter of, of quite a few weeks before the third and fourth floors of McHenry will be open. That's very serious. Uh, you know, there are faculty that are going to have to uh, find out that essentially their teaching method for this quarter has just been totally destroyed, that his students will not be able to get access to books or research papers and things like that. We're calling in consultants uh, to see what we can do. Uh, obviously, it's a dangerous situation, and we're not going to do anything until we know it's safe for people to work in there. What's on the third and fourth floor?